హలో ఫ్రెండ్స్ వెల్కమ్ బ్యాక్ టు మై యూట్యూబ్ ఛానల్ ఫ్రమ్ ఏజిఎస్ టెక్ ఇఫ్ యూ ఆర్ న్యూ టు అవర్ ఛానల్ సబ్స్క్రైబ్ అవర్ ఛానల్ అండ్ క్లిక్ బెల్ ఐకాన్ అండ్ సెట్ ఆల్ నోటిఫికేషన్ ఇఫ్ విల్ సెట్ ఆల్ నోటిఫికేషన్ వి అప్లోడ్ నీ వీడియోస్ యూ విల్ గెట్ నోటిఫికేషన్ ఫ్రమ్ యూట్యూబ్ యూ విల్ గెట్ నోటిఫికేషన్ ఫ్రమ్ యూట్యూబ్ Today we are going to see default some features in tally frame how to we enable this feature in tally frame software we will show it will changes in tally erp9 and first we will see one by one first we will go to how to enable cost under class in voucher and enable stock item additional description and ledger additional description then how to use voucher date field during voucher transaction we will need to change the field is skip you want to change it. you can change skip the date field entry in tally frame you will show we go to tally frame software how to enable this feature we will see in tally frame software we go to first voucher transaction in transaction there is no option available in cost center class first we will see how to enable this cost center class in tally frame software you go to any voucher you press f12 then f12 general detail you will come bottom here it will show select cost center class you will enable this yes and so list of cost center if you want to show cost center employee also you can enable yes otherwise no i will show first no then go to control a save it once enable the cost center it will show in right side cost center classes and it will show list of cost center class available here if you want employee detail also you can select that employee f12 plus f12 you can enable this option also if you want so list of the employees you can enable yes it will show employer include employee then control a that will show employee then we go to next option how to enable stock item additional description first we will see default then how to enable that additional description features once you will select item it will show item allocation screen this is without adding additional description we add additional description you press f12 button come down provide additional description for stock item you can enable yes then control a go to the item yes 
sub form is open discretion of stock item you can enter you can add our additional description for stock item it will show after item exploded detail then we select another item description one then it will show then uh, finally we next point how to add ledger description you go to f12 enable provide additional description for ledger enable that also yes control e you select transportation transportation and packing charges yeah. entering time we does not have permission for change the date it is taken automatically you need to want edit that field and go to f12 you can change the date otherwise you want edit this field voucher date field you go to f12 come general detail downside skip the date field during voucher creation you can give no then control a Here the option is come field is editing currently we we'll change total the transaction field is edited we enable the point we see or four four point x if you want enable otherwise disable the f12 option if you like this video please like share with your friends thank you for watching our channel thank you friends